From KETK, you're watching East Texas Live. Welcome back. Kep Gale with Pets for People is back in studio to tell us about Tulip here. So how are you doing today, Ms. Gale? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm doing awesome. Can you just Good. tell me a little bit about Tulip? Yes, yeah, she is about three and a half months old, and she is a snoodle, which is a schnauzer poodle. And with her being so long, I think she's probably got some Dotson in there somewhere. But her legs are a little bit shorter. And I think she'd be great with the family with children. You know, she's sturdy enough now that she can hold her own. And just a really, really, look at that face. Such a cute, cute little girl. That hair is so shiny. She's so healthy. She's already starting her vaccinations. And she's just, all I can say is she is a happy, happy girl. I love the little fuzzy face. Just a really sweet girl and so per got so much personality and that little tail just wags all the time. Do you think she'll be good with other dogs? Oh, I think she would be. I think she'd be great. And when you start them out this young, I think it makes all the difference as far as them being compatible with other dogs or even cats. So she, I think she might see herself in the monitor. Yeah, she looks Sweet like she's ready to face. play. She's moving so much, she looks like she's ready to play. Mm -hmm, yeah. Do you, you know, where did she come from? She actually was an unwanted litter. Somebody had the dog, the mother dog, and so um, she wasn't spayed. And so she had a litter of puppies that they didn't want, so they brought them to us. And I think there were seven of them in the litter, and we've got a couple of them left. But they're all just healthy, happy, and now all they need is a forever home. Yes, Turn around there. That's so that. sweet. Uh, I know you know, it. East Texas giving they just passed, and you raised about three. $30,000. Oh, yes. What does that mean to have yes. that much money? Well, you know, for nonprofits, we're always struggling for financial assistance. And so this was just a great day for us to kind of put the money back in the coffers so we can do spay and neuters, we can do vaccinations, we can do everything that we have to to take care of these babies. Because our budget's about half a million dollars every year, and it's tough not getting any city or county funding for us to be able to keep our doors open. So with things Things like that, $30,000 helps us continue to keep our doors open and to help all the homeless animals here in East Texas. And just how special is it to have that community support? Oh, it's wonderful because that's what it's all about. We're providing a service, but we need people to support us. So it was really heartwarming to see um, how much support we had from the community. We were just very blessed yesterday. Yes, ma'am. Well, thank you so much for coming in and telling us all about Tulip. You're welcome. Y'all go adopt Tulip. She's so sweet right here. But for more information on Tulip and other dogs, you can go to the website right here on the screen. We'll be back with more KTK's East Texas Live in just a couple of minutes.